Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Chris here, and today I have the review to do for you guys of the Unia U Pouch for the iPod Touch second generation, brought to you guys by Unia. Uh, I want to thank them for being nice enough to go ahead and send me this product for review and another one for a giveaway. Um, so, there's not much more I can say to you guys because this was probably going to be a quick review, but thanks um, for watching. Not yet. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into this. Alright guys, so how are you doing tonight? Uh, I have the review, like I said, of the Unia U-Pouch for the iPod Touch, second generation to do for you guys. Now, with all of my iPad videos that I'm doing, and I will be doing, you guys are getting a little bit worried that I'm not going to do iPod Touch uh, videos anymore. Don't worry about that, I will always be doing iPod Touch videos, I'm just going to add something else um, to my lineup of videos, being the iPad case reviews, iPad application reviews, and things like that. I'm going to be doing more application reviews. Uh, with the iPad because it'll be easier for you guys to see on the bigger screen and it'll be a much better demonstration for you guys. So don't think I'm just going to stop iPod Touch videos and just keep on doing iPad videos. Um, same thing if anything else new comes out and I start doing a lot of videos about that one item, don't think I'm going to end what I did previously. Um, I'll always keep on doing what I'm doing like I tell you guys to do. Um, so without any more of that, let's go ahead and get into this review. So Unia was nice enough to send two cases or two pouches. One will be for giveaway in a later video. So we'll put that one off to the side. I'll keep it nice and new for you guys. And I'll go ahead and open this one right here. This is the U-Pouch, portable pouch. We'll go ahead and slide it out of the packaging here. Put that up there off to the side. Flip that over. And with this, you just get the little foam piece that is inside there. And then you get the pouch itself. Um, put the foam off to the side. And as you guys can see, this pouch right here uh, does stand out. It doesn't, it doesn't look like any other pouch that's out there. Um, which is what everybody and well, which is what I look for in a case or in a pouch or an accessory. It's something that that that, that product stands out and it doesn't remind you of something else. Uh, and it imprints this case and with this specific company in your mind of being that style and with that design. Uh, so it creates a whole new image in your head. And that's what I think this case does and this pouch does. Um, right off the bat, if you guys aren't interested in the zebra print uh, with the black and white. You can get the print in a blue and black. Uh, you can get it in a red and black, a yellow and black. Um, the white and black, as you guys can see here, and uh, the black on black. The case itself, the material that it's made out of, is a nice soft suede. Uh, they have a different style if you're interested on their website, if you're not interested in the suede. Uh, but I do recommend the suede. It feels very nice, very smooth. And the suede also gives it a little bit more grip. Uh, on the inside here, you can see it says U-Pouch, and it says for iPod Touch 2nd Gen and 3rd Gen, and it says Unia, if you guys can see that on the inside there. And this case has a very simple install. All you got to do is take your iPod, go ahead and slip it in the top, feed it down all the way to the bottom. You can grip one side for a little bit of leverage, and just push it till it won't go in anymore, that's what she said. Uh, get it all the way down there to the bottom, and there you go. Your iPod is in there, and it's ready to go. Um, the case itself has a strong knitted construction, so you don't have to worry about any scratches or any bruises um, of any light drops, like just placing it down on a surface. You don't really have to worry about that. There is a little bit of cushioning, believe it or not, in this pouch uh, because of the suede being nice and uh, thick. Um, it has, because of the suede, it has that comfortable non-slip grip. So you guys can see here, I'm holding it just about at an, uh, a nice angle, and it's not coming out of my hand. Uh, this case feels very, very nice. It was very nicely done. Uh, the stitching all the way around the outside, there's no imperfections on the stitching. It's perfect. Uh, nothing's coming out. You guys can see just all around there, the stitching looks very nice. Um, on the bottom of this case, there's um, a little bit of almost like a... Um, uh, mesh material down here. Now, I believe that's for your speakers because you guys know the iPod speakers are actually inside the iPod and the sound comes out of the bottom of the dock. Um, so that's where the sound can come out of. So you can go ahead and you can play music while your iPod is still in here and you can have it go through this nice little mesh right here while you're still having your iPod protected and covered at the same time. Uh, so the speakers can still uh, work while you have the case on so they don't muffle um, so the case doesn't muffle the sound or the music that your iPod happens to be playing, which I haven't seen in any other case, which is an awesome design. Um, other pouches might just leave it open. That leaves your iPod open to damage as well. But this with the little mesh right there so your sound can still pass through, but uh, still enough material so it can be protected is a great idea. Um, all around, it's a very nice uh, pouch. Like I said, I'm not really a pouch person because I do like to have a case on my iPod 
and it's pretty easy to get out. You gotta just have to keep your iPod in there for a, a little while. The case will form fit to your iPod, and then you could just use it whenever you could sit it on here. It gives the iPod a nice little grip too. Sit it on here, do what you gotta do, lock it up, and then just slide it back down into the case, throw it in your pocket, and you're ready to go. Play music, do what you wanna do. Uh, all around, I think this is a great case if you're or pouch, if you may say. And it is available on Unia's website for $19.95. Um, like I said, if you're not interested in this white and black, which is really cool, you can check out the other colors, blue, red, yellow, and the black on black. Um, like I said, guys, all around, really nice pouch, high quality, and for around $20, bucks, uh, if I were to buy a pouch, this would be the one. Uh, great case from Unia, great job, Unia. You guys knew what you were doing when you were making this case, putting this together. And uh, I do, I really love the feel of the suede material and the other materials that this case is put together with. Um, definitely go ahead and check this case out on Unia's website. Um, the link will be in the bottom bar, or whatever you guys prefer to call it now. Um, but please, guys, uh, when you're done watching this video, which should be about now, uh, please thumbs up this video right down there. Uh, comment on your opinions and thought on this case, thoughts on this case. Tell me what you think about it. Tell me if you would rock it. Tell me if you would purchase it. Um, and tell me if you like the zebra print, or tell me if you'd purchase a different color if you were to get one, or what color, and what color would that color be. Um, so, thanks guys for watching this video. Like I said, favorite, comment, thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thanks to you, Nia. Thanks to you guys for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Oh, peace.